You smell burnt flesh? That's my fingers. Gun overheated in the last fight. So, all that one-shot kill stuff you do, where'd you learn it? It was part of my training. I can show you exercises if you like. Yeah, I like getting off more than around a minute. I learned to shoot with a friend of mine. First year out of rat attack, I was a mess. Me and Ams Michelle hooked up on a tramp freighter. She was running too. We stole a holdout blaster and shared it. You were young, innocent. Just looking to protect yourself. I was. She was something else. She had gang connections, so one time we were raiding the ship's cargo bay, planning to sell whatever we get. Turns out it was an exchange ship, syndicate stuff. We've just pried open the storage crates when we figure it out. We're dead meat, right? They must have had quite a reputation. You cross the exchange, they track you down and cut you up. Best we can figure, I torch the place while Ampsby grabs a dock worker. Then we sit and wait for the exchange. Enforcers finally show. We blame the dock worker and say we came to stop it. Prove our exchange material. They bought it. Risky. But I guess it paid off. Best kind of risk. Amspichel ended up worse off later, but it was great for me. She was fun. We have a run into her, we should get together. Time of the century. Wait! I've done nothing to you! I've touched nothing on this dust ball! No talk to no one! Are you Vjord Yarnall? You know who I am. You wouldn't be here otherwise. The Dark Council hired you, didn't it? Or the Galactic Republic. The Macrosa Order. The Huts. Uh, it doesn't matter. My master is dead. Darth Jadis is gone. I have no one left to betray. I'm not asking you to betray anyone. Darth Jorid sent me. Jorid? Ah! The idiot girl thinks she can equal her father, eh? You really don't understand. Lord Jadis must have made preparations for his death. He was power, and fire, and brilliance. The instant the Master died, I promise his contingency plans went into action. They'll bring doom to everything Lord Jadis ever touched, and I want no part of it. It's already too late for that. Fool! Everyone Jadis ever touched will all be destroyed! still alive, but he's not getting up soon. Now we have to drag him to the ship. Let's load him up and get going. You know, you'd think a high-up advisor would carry a few more credits. This is Keeper to Cypher 9. I understand you're running an errand for Darth Jorid. It may not be my place to know a Dark Council member's business, so I won't ask what she wants. I only want to advise you to take care. That's unusually thoughtful of you, Keeper. These are unusual circumstances. Would that they were different. Jorid has relocated to Darth Jadis' old chambers on Drummond Cass. She awaits you there. Keeper, out. Agent, we need to talk. I just heard from Headquarters. Keeper finally came through on a promise he made when I joined up. Keeper is contacting you instead of me now. Some watcher sent the message. Not really the point. I asked you guys to find Anne Spichel, old friend of mine. I told you about her. We hooked up after I left Rat Attack. Last time I saw her, she saved my life and got me to Hada. I owe her big. Now she's in trouble. You live a dangerous life, it catches up with you. No kidding. She crossed some exchange buddies on Nar Shadda. Report didn't give details, but I can guess how it went down. I'm gonna head over, kill the exchange, and save the girl. You should come with. You want my help? You've got it. Let's go. Good choice. 
And so you know, we do this right, I've got a surprise plan for us. I think that's most of the gang. Hey, Ange, get out here. You're rescuing me? What am I, your princess? If you were a princess, <laughs> you might be worth something. Shut up and toss me a gun. Who's your friend? You must be Anne Spichel. It's a pleasure to finally meet you. Yeah? How'd a guy like you end up with her? He has better taste than you think. Found him at Nemro the Hut's place. But don't hold that against him. Wasn't planning to. You guys timed it good. By the way, they were gonna hang me to Broil on a hollow sign. You got a way off world? Grab your stuff and meet us at the spaceport. I can get you a ride. You have a plan to get her off, Narshada? Not quite. Remember I said I had a surprise for you? There's a bounty on Anne Spichel. We saved her, we own her, now we're gonna sell her. We came here to rescue her. You told me she saved your life. She did. You wanna know how? She stuffed me in a box and shipped me to Hutta. I spent 12 weeks in muck working for a chem farmer. She humiliated me. I owe her for that too. I had doubts about this mission from the start. Now I find you've misled me. You don't have to do anything. I'll handle it. And you get half the money. She'll be waiting in the hangar either way. Think about it. Hey, you made it all right. Yeah. Ran into one of Zenjo's guys. Left him a scar, but he's still breathing. So a ride sounds good right now. Give me 20 minutes, I'll set you up. Keep her company. I'll be back soon. I really do appreciate the help, but... Can I ask you something? This rescue isn't what it looks like. Kaleo plans to sell you to a bounty hunter. Right. Of course she does. She's a freak. She blames you for what happened to her on Hutter. She's a habitual liar. She tell you the sob story about leaving Ratatak, meeting me, all that. None of it's true. We hooked up a year ago, and she'd been on her own forever. I gotta go. Don't believe anything she says. So where is she? I've got a bounty hunter waiting. She must have caught on. She slipped out while I was on the ship. Don't you dare. You let her go. You let her go! Now she's out there and she thinks she's better than me. What were you thinking? You bring me out here on a rescue mission, then you tell me we're selling a woman to bounty hunters. Fine, Agent. Next time, I won't ask. So remember how I was gonna sell Anne Spichel to a bounty hunter and you let her go? I hope it was worth it. Finally convinced the buyer we weren't trying to scam him. You and Anspe talk much when you were together? Swap stories about the old days? Gossip about me? She said you were a habitual liar and that you'd only met in the past year. Yeah, figure she'd say something like that. She's kind of crazy. Whole thing got me thinking, though. I've had a lot of partners over the years. Her, Namro, guy named Rawl used to hijack Republic supply ships. He had money, he had brass. How you think you measure up? You're really comparing me to your former partners. Don't be like that. Just figuring why with all the nasty, smart, rich people I've been with, I ended up with you. We all need a break from the high life sometimes. I'm just joking, Agent. Joking. Get used to it. Dear Cypher, I was just listening to Lord Ulius' latest opera. Music brightens my day, and we of the Council have few bright days. You can't imagine the burden. I'm sure I can't. So, Fioriano, is that him? Or is this another body for my collection? I can drop him with the others if you like. Oh, no, Yanol is delicate. He must be treated with care. Yanol and I are going to spend some time together. 
He's going to reveal every secret my father ever had. Expect a token of my appreciation. And expect to be called on again, my cipher. It'll give me something to look forward to. Think of it. Dream of me, and of your service to me. Transmitting security codes, this is Watcher 2 to Cypher 9. I'm glad you're back on duty. After you dismantled the cells on Balmora and Nashadar, the rest of the Terra network went into overdrive. How are they responding, exactly? Increased chatter, transfer of goods, activation of safe houses. Fascinating, really. I told you before about the Eagle's mystery weapon, the Eradicator devices. We still don't know what they are, but we intercepted this transmission. Once the devices are fully functional, I'll enter the targeting codes myself. Only then will instructions be sent. But all cells are encouraged to prepare attacks on secondary targets. Once the eradicators cause chaos in every Imperial stronghold, you must fan the flames. Stand tall above the wreckage. Shape the destruction into a message. That is how we prevail. That was the Eagle himself. It seems the assassination of Darth Jadis was only the start. We've eliminated two of his terror cells. We can stop this. I've run the odds. I wish I were as certain as you. There is good news. We have leads on two new terror cells, vital to the network's operation. They're your next targets. Proceed to Tatooine and Alderaan at your discretion. Your mission will continue there. Watcher 2 out. Hey, Agent. Take a look at this. Where is she? I, I don't know. How would I know? Kaleo Janus and her Twi'lek associate were seen attacking exchange resources on Nar Shaddaa. Should I believe you wouldn't seek revenge? I want her last known location and I want it now! I love it. Listen to that little tremor in his voice. He's adorable. He does say your name with fondness. Ijal and I go way back. As soon as I show my face, he starts torturing people to track me down. He's been obsessed ever since we split up on Farstein. For an arms dealer, he's kind of sweet. Makes me feel wanted. If you've got such a bond, why not let him find you? Not much of a game then, is it? Of course, if he ever found me, I'd have to choose. Do I go back with a bad, nasty man? Or stick with the one I have? If you're trying to make me jealous, it won't work. Then how do I know you even care? I'll keep you in the loop. Next recording gets out, we can watch it together. <laughs>